Hello, welcome. This is going to be my first time doing this, so if I'm a bit shaky, my apologies. This is a Spider Frost fic, a Peter Slash Loki fic. I hope you enjoy. A Night of Understanding by Alex Black. Searching, recklessly, looking endlessly, where is she? Mother? Battlefield, fighting, pain, where is she? Mother! There in the distance, fighting her own battle, when suddenly, blood. Oh, by the Norse! Mother! Breathing heavily, eyes darting around the room. Loki awoke from his slumber, the restlessness prompting him to get up. His eyes drifted over the clock. 2.36. A perfect time for him to be up without anyone bothering in his sleep clothes. He first wandered to the common room and settled himself down to read, quickly came to realise that he was still just as restless as he was in his own room, and took to wandering around the compound. He didn't have a destination in mind when he started wandering, just walking through the halls wherever his feet took him. He startled slightly when he came to a door. He truly wasn't aiming for a specific place, but he supposed it isn't surprising he ended up at this door. Peter's door. Peter, who was kind to him without fail. Peter, who somehow seemed to know him better than anyone else. Peter, who seemed so severely underestimated by everyone else. Peter, who he came for, came to care for so deeply he couldn't fathom to put it into words. Peter, who didn't feel the same way. He hesitated to knock. What if he was disturbing him? What if he was turned away? What if he was angry at him for waking him? What if... He took a deep breath and straightened his posture. A gentle rustling could be heard from the other side of the door. Before the door was being opened with Peter there in his boxes and the sleep shirt. Loki? Is everything okay? Loki was momentarily stunned, lost at what to say. I, um, I couldn't sleep. And you didn't want to be alone? Loki nodded in affirmation. Peter simply stepped aside as, as a silent invitation. Loki walked, walking in soundlessly, taking in the room. That had maps of city tacked to one of the walls used to track cases a few miscellaneous posters a desk a queen-size bed and two bookshelves one with school books and one that related to other interests peter gave him a minute to take in the room before taking his hand and slowly leading him to the bed peter come lay with me why would i because you need your rest, sweetheart. Peter, I don't think I'll be able to. He trailed off. It's all right. I'll do my best to keep the nightmares away. He said so softly, with such an achingly kind smile, he couldn't help but comply and lay down with him. How did you know it was... I know you, sweetheart. Now try and get some sleep. Loki obliged with his request and cuddled and cuddled close when Peter wrapped his arm around him tightly. Loki obliges with his request and cuddles close when Peter wraps him tightly in his arms. Maybe Peter doesn't feel so differently from him as he thought. Well, that was rather simple, rather short, but I thought I might as well for the first time. Thank you very much for listening. Have a nice night.